Today we are going to have a cool experiment. We are going to compare Zoom to Zoom meetings. We'll see how each one of those applications are working in real time. Okay? I have in the backyard my son and he has a computer waiting for a connection. I am going to initiate Zoom meetings. I will try to initiate a chat control his computer using Zoom meeting and see how the interaction works and then I will do exactly the same with Zoom. Let's begin. So first of all, I am going to start a video conferencing and by the way, I am not going to start checking different features. The idea of this session is just checking the, the quality of the meeting, how is, it, how is the feeling of using the application just something like a normal user without starting to dig too much into uh, features. So let's start a video conferencing meeting. And it's loading. And let's start computer audio. Very good. And I will start the meeting. I will send my son the link. Okay, the link was sent. And if I'm just looking in terms of a user on the system, I can see that I can easily uh, see the attendees, no problem. I can see that I can initiate a chat. I can see that I have some settings here. And I can start sharing my screen. And I can lock the meeting. That's very cool, actually. So Zoom also has this, this feature, as far as I know, which is very cool. I can record the session. Let's record it. I can disable the video and I can disable Unmuted. my microphone. Okay, very good. So I can do all that. Uh, let's see when I'm, I am sharing my screen. Let's see if I can share a specific screen. So let's try to share a uh, Windows Media Player. Perfect. So let's see. Hey, Eli. Uh, I, I think your mic is off. Oh, no, it's on. But I cannot, I cannot hear you. No, I cannot hear you. Hello? I Wait, can hear now? you now. Did, did you do something, by the way, or it just started to work by itself? Um, I, I just did the classic on and off. Got it. So you, you just had to... To, to I to mute and unmute yeah okay okay so I see you a little bit blurry do you see me okay um I'm actually seeing your screen right now but um uh, you look a little bit small because I'm not small I'm big ah ah you do look a little bit blurry on um, but even though you're quite small Okay, now tell me something. Uh, I shared an application window. Which application do you see? Um, I can't really tell what it is, but it looks like you have files out and... Okay, but you um, cannot see my entire screen. It looks like a media player. That's right, so I, I shared only one. Okay, so try to share your screen. Okay. Okay. Now, now I can see you okay, by the way. Maybe because Wait. I shared my screen, it was a bit off. You, on my end, you look a little bit blurry. Okay. And now? It, yeah, you changing your position made, made everything so much better. <laughs> it's amazing. Okay. Okay, yeah. Uh, my entire screen, just, I'll just share my window. Yeah, just show your screen, whatever. Okay. Very good. So now I can see your screen. Let's see if I can take over your machine. Um, let's see settings. And request control. Um, uh, it actually it popped up right on my screen. Um, okay. This time, yeah. So, uh, now, one inconvenient thing is every time you have to open up a completely individual launcher. Oh, so, so it's now asking you to, to do it again? Um, no, you just have to go, even if you download it already, you still have to go out of your way to open it up on a completely different um, thing. 
Do you can you check if you have Zoom meetings installed on your computer? I think I think I, that I do. I, I find out. Oh, I have it installed. Bissell says you have to open it. Yeah, right. Right. I'm opening it. Got it. So so just to give you a background, this is the second time that we're trying to do it. The first time that we did it. Eli joined the meeting and then the system requested him to download Zoom meeting and now it's the second time that we're running the same meeting and instead of using the same downloaded file it really asked him to do it again. So did you just download the application again or just you just launched the existing one? I tried the, the mute and unmute because I can't hear you anymore. Is everything okay? okay yeah. Um, I, I tried um, opening it and it, it, it opened the launcher that I already had installed. Okay. It was um, a while. Okay. So, so I can see that the, 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 the video quality is off. You're, you're very choppy. You look like a, a ninja turtle. Okay, very good. Okay. On your end, um, you're not choppy, but you're blurry. Yeah, so you're not blurry, but you're choppy. <laughs> okay, so let's try to take over your machine. So I am now trying to work with Firefox. It's loaded pretty good. It's a, it's a bit slow. Yeah. It, it is slow, yeah, it's very slow. Do you hear your computer working hard, the fan work, something like that? Um, so far, not, nothing major. I, I think um, it's running normally on my end. Okay, okay. But but it's very slow for me. So I'm, um, uh, I'm trying... Because I can only see what you're doing. See, when you put an input, I can only see um, what happens at the end. No, no, it, 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 it is slow. It's, it's not a fun experience. It's not fun. Not, not at all. It's very choppy. It's very slow. If, if I, I, I needed to work on a client's computer using Zoom meeting, I would probably kill myself half of the session. Yeah, it's, it's not fun. Not a good experience. Okay, so that's one. Let's see if you, you, you are able to spot the chat. So I am writing you a chat. And okay. let, let's see if you um, are able to see it and respond. Okay. Okay. So you're. Was it a problem for you to spot the chat? No. Um. It, it glows red. It's all in one bar. Right? It's simple. Okay. So I I think the only the only two problems that I found with uh, with Zoom meeting so far is the the video quality is not great and there is a significant delay when we are sharing screen so yeah. so that that that's my feedback um let's close this session and I'm going to send you another link for Zoom we'll see how it goes there okay Okay, fantastic. Thank you. See you next time. Okay, let's exit and meeting. Good. So that was meeting number one. This meeting is being recorded. Okay, I am launching Zoom right now. I will copy the link and I will copy the link and send it to my son. So in Zoom, the feeling is that I am I have almost the same features like Zoom meeting. I can start and uh, 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 the recording. I can share specific screens, so I can do it as well. May maybe here it's a bit more sexy when when I see it like that and not uh, in a list view like it was in Zoom meeting. So maybe that's a bit sexy. Uh, I can have the chat. I see polls that is not really an option in Zoom meetings. I don't know how many people use the polls in Zo in Zoom or Zoom or or if, you know video conferencing, but it is a feature out there. I'm using uh, I'm using um, video conferencing for the past you know, five years, and I never used the poll in my life. 
you can see also the people that it said are attending I can see that it takes him a bit of a time to to log in lots of little time okay so we'll wait for him and I can see in the security to uh, the ability to lock the meeting same like Zoom meeting I can allow and disallow different features which I, I didn't see it in Zoom meetings maybe it's there I didn't see it and what else I can I then show my my video now I look like I'm in space okay uh, there is a way here to choose a virtual background you can change the background and just see my green screen or you can change it to some other background uh, let's go with uh, my fake office that's nice okay so fake office it is and Eli I'm hello Lior hey how are you you're good I'm fantastic <laughs> nice to see you perfect can, can you show us the background it looks like a nice background yeah um, it's um, a very very 3d background very 3d this is my office by the way so my office is on the lake and this is this is my office and Eli is right now he came to visit me and he is actually on the deck shooting this video very nice okay so uh, let's see if I can chat with you and you can see it's easily and everything is good there let's see so chat yeah so you're good with the chat from what I can see, um, the bar is very similar to Zoho meetings. It's um, yeah. exactly the same place. Uh, like uh, until now, the the interface Zoom is a little bit more sexy, but in terms of functionality, it's almost the same. Now, I will allow you to share screen because by default it's turned off. So try to share your screen. Yeah. Um. From what I can see, um. It, uh, I think Zoho Meeting has a similar feature, which allows you to share a very specific um, you know, um, window, which I think you showed. Also, Zoho Meeting. Yeah, but here uh, um, uh, it looks a lot easier from what I saw. It's um, all laid out right in front of you, so I'm going to share it. Yes, I also think that it's it's a bit more sexy. So let's try to ask for remote control. That was very simple from my side. I think also in Zoom meeting it was okay. And with Zoom meeting when we took over, actually you were looking a bit odd, but you, I'll see you fine. Can you move your hands? So for, um, you, before you looked a little bit blurry, but now you're um, actually um, very fine. Every now and then you... Did you problem. tell your father that your father is blurry? I am your father, Luke. I am your father. Do you have another son that I don't know about? I am your father. Okay. So let's see what's going on. So let me try to play around here. All my hard work. <laughs> it's actually pretty good. I am able to control your screen in real time. There are no delays. Yep. It's all good. Okay, so I'm able to control your screen pretty good. Um, so I think that this is this is a very very uh, significant change from from Zoom meeting. When in Zoom meeting, I was not really able to uh, enjoy controlling the screen of Eli. It was it was choppy and, and slow and not nice. Okay, so I think I'm good, Eli. Thank you, thank you for helping me with this video. You're getting okay. half of the revenue, okay? Oh, I'm <laughs> joking, joking. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, so the bottom line is that my feeling as a user was okay with both of them. I didn't have a big problem with any of the applications. The only disadvantage came when we shared screen. So it, it was a bit choppy. It wasn't a nice feeling on Zoom meeting when in Zoom uh, it was pretty much pretty good. I can tell you that 
when I am meeting clients, most of the time I will need to take over their computers because I need to code on their Zo CRM or Zo applications. So I am using Zoom as my video conferencing application. But my team members, they are using Zo meeting because when they are communicating, communicating between them or when they need to have internal meetings, we are using Zo meetings. The reason is that Zo meetings is coming free of charge as part of my Zo one. So I don't need to pay additional fee to use Zo meeting. From the other side, I do need to pay for Zoom license. So in my company, we have two Zoom licenses. One is mine, which I am conducting all my client meetings using Zoom. And there is another floating license that it will be used by one of the team members in, in case that he needs to meet clients. When we are meeting clients in the company, it will always be with Zoom because my company name is Amazing Business Results and not Mediocre Business Results. And when we are meeting clients, we need to have quality and quality for now it's with Zoom. When we have internal meetings, I'm perfectly fine to have some choppiness in the video. It's not that important. If there is small delay in the audio and I need to ask my employee to say the same thing again one time, it's not that bad. So we're using internally ZO meetings. So this is basically how I work with both of them. I know lots of uh, companies that they are doing exactly what I'm doing. Even if they have 40, 50, 60 employees, Zoom will, be, uh, will have just few licenses to have meetings with clients and uh, the entire company will have access to Zoom meetings and they will be able to use that. So again, it's a, it's a cost effective solution. I will really appreciate your feedback. So in this video, I want you to shoot in the comments. I really want it. Please shoot in the comments your opinion. It's really important for me to see the audience, how they like Zoom or Zoom meetings. And the more you can describe uh, your experience with one of them or both, it will really help uh, me and I will also take the same knowledge and I will transfer it to Zo so they can improve their product. Thank you very much for watching this session. I really appreciate you taking the time. It's a long session. I will see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.